An LGBTQ symbol removed from Miller North High School draws scrutiny from students, families, and a state senator. Good evening, I'm Bill Shamert. Tonight, the district admits it removed a flag, but KTV News Watch 7's Alex McClune joins the slide to explain why they are calling this a misunderstanding. Alex. Bill, the district is responding to social media posts, including some from State Senator Megan Hunt, who says she contacted Miller Public Schools officials about not allowing symbols associated with the human rights campaign. This all after a family says their daughter went to the school principal when she heard a human rights flag was removed from a classroom. I went and talked to him myself and I really didn't get much clarification from that either. This week, Millard North Jr. Scar Connor says she heard a human rights flag, similar to this pride flag, was removed from a classroom. She says one of her teachers was upset, so she went to the school principal to get clarity about why an LGBTQ plus advocacy group wasn't allowed to show support for students. It very much felt targeted. Millard Public Schools released its statement Friday, explaining what it calls a misunderstanding. Millard says several weeks back, we had a specific issue regarding a display, which in part included the removal of a pride flag. The district said it doesn't discuss specific issues involving students or staff in detail, but says these guidelines were misunderstood, saying Millard asks that staff not bring politics or advocacy organizations into the classroom unless otherwise directly related to some element of the district approved curriculum. Millard North seniors Rook and Faith say they just want to leave their school knowing it's welcoming for other LGBTQ plus students. Next year and the year after, my siblings and my cousins are all going to go to that school and they might have to sit through some really awful stuff. Here with like the mass shooting and like the don't say gay bill going around, it's it's scary to think that that could be the next step at our school. These Millard North students hope symbols for safe spaces return so students can move forward. Just having someone you can go to to talk to your problems without judgment and knowing they won't judge you for who you are. The district says it does not have policies preventing symbols in school. So again, saying this was a misunderstanding, you can read Millard Public Schools full statement in this story at KETV.com. Bill, back to you.